This Samsung TV being 130 inches is the least cool thing about it. Dude, that TV is a micro RGB. I've only seen one of these in person and it's like an OLED, but better, let me explain. To produce color, most TVs will take a white backlight, crank it up super bright, and run it through a bunch of color filters. Problem is, in that filtering process, the color loses a lot of vibrance, and it can never really produce black, because that backlight is always on. OLEDs get rid of the backlight, get rid of the filters, and basically just have a bunch of little pixels that light up all the different colors by themselves. That has two benefits. First of all, the color is super pure, and second of all, it can achieve perfect black, because it can just turn off the pixel. The problem with OLED is brightness. With normal LED TVs, you can pump the LEDs with more power and they get brighter. But this isn't normal LED. It's organic LED. The pixels in an OLED are made out of organic matter. They're making light through a chemical reaction. You can't just pump them with more power and expect them to get brighter. And that's where micro RGB TVs come in to solve both problems. They solve the OLED brightness problem by using a normal LED backlight that they can pump full of power. But the colors can still be insanely vibrant because instead of using filters, the backlight itself is a bunch of very small red, green, and blue LEDs, or if you prefer, micro RGBs. Basically, the colors pop. They really pop. 